Plaintiffs J. John Young Glenn and his mom, Nicole Glenn, say Nicole has known the defendant her entire life, and they once argued after discovering they were dating the same man. Nicole is suing because she claims J. John was driving her car and the defendant's boyfriend ran a stop sign and hit him. Defendants Asia Bell and her boyfriend Jerry Flanoid say Nicole is full of drama and Asia has even helped her out while she was in jail by putting money on her books. Asia insists the accident was not Jerry's fault, so they deny owing. Start with you. Okay, um, Your Honor, I've been knowing Ms. Bell um, pretty much all her life. My niece is her cousin on her father's side. I'm on her mother's side. Um, I've had several run-ins with Ms. Bell in which they did not end out on a good note. About what? Um, once we was actually dating the same guy, um, she was, I guess, felt some type of way about that issue. Wow. Um, she stalked us for quite some time. Um, we ended up getting married, had a kid. Oh, this gentleman here? No, 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 that's my oh, son. That's what I thought. <laughs> You were pointing at him. Huh? You, you kept doing that. Um, Go ahead. We also had a, um, a um, altercation back in um, 2007 where Ms. Bell and one of her friends was hosting stripper parties. Well, my niece stripped for them at the party and they refused to pay her. My niece had property that belonged to them, wigs or shoes or whatever it was, and they called themselves trying to fight her over the issue, the girl actually came to my house. Miss Bell knew better than to come to my house, but the girl did come and it was a physical altercation or whatnot. Let me hear from you, young lady, regarding your relationship. I do not deal with her because she's just full of drama. She's a liar, for one. Um, they like to fight and argue. They whom? Both of them. Her and her son? <laughs> mm -hmm. okay. Yes, sir. Um, drink and do drugs, your honor. She, How do uh, you know? She's a crackhead, Your Honor. I thought you don't deal with me. How you know that? Well, back in 2000. That's not true. Yeah, no, see, it's true, Your Honor. She acting right now. She's in her acting Man, mode. you don't have to explain to me what crackheads look like. <laughs> well, this is back in 2008, Man, Your Honor. You all don't get along because she I put money is... on her books, Your Honor, while she's in jail. Quiet. I put money on her books. What was she in jail for? Drugs, Your Honor. See, girl, you was a little kid. What are you talking about? Her, she used to answer the mm. phone. Her grandmother used to take my step, my well, let's get to the thing. car she's not paying you for. Your, your money that she's taking and putting on her back and on her wrist. I know. You want your car she to get to, fixed. Yeah, your money is right there. That's what she needs to that do. That sharp top I mean, is on the fresh nails. You got I mean, your feet done, too. You got your it. diamonds. No That's where your I money is. You will never get your car fixed. I know. My car fixed. My car is fixed. I'm talking about hers. Oh, OK. <laughs> She's talking about her car fix. Tell me how she owes you, man. I believe that was what? April 2018, mm -hmm. I allowed my son to use my car. Um, he was down in the city, which is a bad part of St. Louis. Jerry was driving her car, ran a stop sign, hit my car, uh, my truck. That's a lie, you're on. My son called me. He, I heard a bunch of arguing in the background. They were all going back and forth, the altercation broke out, a physical altercation broke That's out. That's a lie, Your Honor. But he can uh, tell you more about That's that. That's a lie. Let me hear from him. So April 28th, I was over at uh, one of my friend's house. Um, I was about to leave the area to go back to pick up my mom from work. And as I, I make a complete stop at a stop sign and I continue into the street and he runs the stop sign with Miss Bell's lie. son in the back seat, which is not his child. Now, now you mm -hmm. trip. Go ahead. <laughs> and um, so after that, I get out of the car. I, I pull oh, over to the side name? of the road. Yes. And I get out of the hey, car. And <laughs> um, Don't hold on, him. they debating who the baby daddy is. <laughs> she know, she know the that. daddy or not? She know that ain't that yeah. baby daddy. Why didn't you all that go baby, through all this so we could have given you a DNA test? I know her. I'm not him. Well, your son can't have kids because he like boys. <laughs> okay. Okay, right, right. What's wrong with that? Nothing's wrong with that. Well, then why are you not acting like he's talking about? Hey, he's worried about who's no, the baby father. No, he's, no, like, he's not, he's not even not planning to have kids, Your Honor. That's, That's what your mama say. Anyway, um, 
Yeah. I get out of the car, and um, of course. And by I'm the a, way, I'm, sir, you need to know, and all the other he folks who try to make reference to somebody's sexuality, particularly if they're trying to degrade. Uh, You're talking or, about kids, something acting, that he's planning yeah, on not that having. Had nothing running. to do with. He's not having no, nothing. He's not, not having nothing to do with it, this so. situation. God's law and man law. That's what you think. You quote one quote where Jesus said it was a sin, and those who protest so much, they like. Men themselves. You Sounds keep good. slamming the man good. about his I sexuality. said one thing, Your Honor. You said well, I keep talking about what God. You said it three times. I said three things. I ain't even said nothing else said, beside my you name. You mentioned he likes boys three times. Go ahead, after he man. mentioned about my son, something that he planned on never having. He's not having kids there like you go. Boys. There you go. Get him out of here. Okay. Get going. Really Let's go. Get going. <laughs> if you talk crazy, I'm going to hold you in contempt and dismiss this case. Young man, you were explaining the accident yes. to me. Um, as I got out of the car, of course, I'm upset, you know, I'm cursing or whatnot. And he he comes over, he's like, look, I don't want to do this. I don't want, I got my son in the, in, um, in the back of the car. And I'm on the phone, I have to call the police. I'm on the phone with my mom and I walk away because it's really loud because the firefighters are already there, their alarm is going off. So I walk away so that I can hear me on my mom's conversation. And Jerry runs over to me trying to fight. I was with my friend and his baby mom, his baby mother. Um, and she, they both was in the car when the accident happened. And the mother then, so of his children he is jumped, what he they end up. Be they get into a conversation. They, we all end up fighting or whatnot. And um, y'all fought. Yeah. Yeah. He got physical. We did. Yeah. Y'all need to cut. And it. your honor, the 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 bottom line of this story y'all need is to accident. Never, Tell he, me about the liability. How does he and her owe for the accident? Okay. When I got the police report, I realized that it was her car involved in the uh -huh. accident. His name as the driver. Uh -huh. Their insurance information, in which I check with the insurance mm -hmm. company, no policy. I called Miss Bill, and I spoke with her. She three-wayed him in the phone call, and Lie. he started going about how he knew the insurance policy was fake, that it was a fake insurance card, just in case somebody say they was hurt and try to sue them. Yeah. Just stupid. Insurance stuff. has no real bearing on culpability and right. the judgments that are issued. Mm -hmm. So the question is, did they ever agree to pay for the damage or found to be liable for the damage? Yes, she did agree to pay to have the damages fixed, but she wanted me to pay for all right, the Ma'am, did you agree to have no, the car sir. fixed? No, Your Honor. All right. Do you feel that you all are liable at all? Not at all. All right. Do anyone have a police report that I details do. what happened? You do? Yes. Send it to me. And it's actually pretty faulty. Okay. Stop lying. Get y'all life together. Come on, girl. Get your Stop life it. together. You get your life together. Now my life together. No, no it's not. Mm -hmm. Fail to not yield. At all. Fail to yield. Go I to wasn't school. There. Fail to I wasn't yield. There, I wasn't there, y'all. I wasn't there. Judgment for the plaintiff. <laughs> Thank you. Grow up. Ooh. Get you a real man, baby. Girl. He ain't nothing. You a liar. He ain't nothing. I ain't got nothing to say to them. They liars. You They're liars. liars. You're a liar. You should apologize. They would have pressed charges on me. Felony. Why? Why? Why when you got beat up? Beat up by who? Yeah, yeah, at the time they would send mm -hmm. me to prison for touching mm -hmm. him. I'm yeah, smarter than that. Up, I had my license longer than he's been alive. He's lying to you. I yeah. knew about he's gonna go find his little boyfriend. You don't care.